Hello, it's Justin from Attack Train here, and this week I'm looking at an add-on for Google Sheets, which is the spreadsheet application uh, within Google Drive. Sometimes uh, I find I need to put dummy data into a spreadsheet uh, to carry out some demonstration of something, perhaps within the classroom or to test out some formulas, and you need to put in some dummy random data. And there's a fantastic add-on which I highly recommend if, like me, you need to put random data into a spreadsheet sometimes. And it's called, when we type in random, it's called Random Generator. It's the one by Ablebits.com, the peach-coloured icon with the green dice. So click on the blue free button. It'll ask you for your permission, so simply click allow. And then within a few seconds, that will be active. There we are. And so if we go to the add-ons toolbar at the top and we click on Random Generator and Start to open up the sidebar, we have a range of different choices. Let's start with integer. So I could generate a random number from anything I like, let's say from 50 to 500. Um, and we can choose unique values as well so that no one number is repeated. If I click Generate, that puts that random number into the selected cell. But if I was to click and drag a whole bunch of cells and click Generate, it'll fill them all up with random data and again using unique values. So you have the option to put in random numbers, random integers. You also have real numbers. These are ones with decimal fractions to them as well, from 0.1 up to whatever you like. So they can have fractions in them. Uh, you've got Boolean, which is either true or false, or yes or no. So again, I could select a column of cells here, click the Generate button, and get a random selection of trues and falses in there. Uh, we also have dates. So if we click on Date here, you can have some random dates. I find this really useful. This is a particularly uh, useful one. Uh, let's go back in time, go from 1st of May 2015, uh, right up to uh, 16th or so of December. We can choose the weekends or work days, and again, we can have unique values. So let's put in a table here of random dates. There we are. Uh, so again, it's quite useful if you're setting up worksheets or spreadsheets for students, perhaps, if you're a teacher like myself. So you might be setting up random data for them to play around with, to test out formulas or uh, sorting, filtering, things like that. Uh, we've got custom lists, so you can create your own list. It's got some built-in ones here for weekdays and months, but you can have a list of anything you like. Uh, for example, it could be random names, random addresses, postcodes. You know, you, you come up with your own list, and it'll then uni, uh, use those. Uh, and finally, you have strings as well. Now, this could be useful if you're setting up passwords, perhaps. Uh, this can allow you to create a range of um, different text strings using symbols, using uppercase, lowercase numbers. You have the option to put spaces in there. Um, and you can set up basic templates using this mask option here. If I set this uh, string length to 14, uh, then what I can do is, if I just widen that uh, column there, um, let's have 20 passwords. Click Generate, and there's your 20 passwords generated. Uh, all of which are pretty good. So this random generator, really, really useful for setting up uh, filler data, test data, setting up uh, spreadsheets for students to use, perhaps creating templates. I think there's a great little utility that um, I'm, I'm quite fond of this. So I hope that you found that useful. If you did, please do give this thumbs up, uh, this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to go and rate this add-on as well. So when you do download it, install it into Google Sheets, you'll have the option of going through to um, the page for this and clicking on the star rating. That always helps the developer. And um, yeah, if you haven't subscribed already to the channel, please do click the subscribe button at the bottom right corner of the video. And I hope very much to see you in a future video. Thank you very much for watching. Bye for now.